Hello everyone, welcome back. I want to give you guys an update on my Halson 507K. It's been six weeks since I changed the battery. I did put in a Duracell like a number of people have uh, recommended. Uh, same thing, you know, somewhere between four weeks and uh, eight weeks battery life. Uh, let me get behind the camera and you'll be able to see the blinky blinky. See if I get this to focus. There it is. All right, now, for, you can see it blinking, and also you can see there's a big difference with the sun out, and also a difference when you have a white backdrop. So because I'm outdoors and there's snow on the ground here for, I don't know, at least uh, four months out of the year, I have to have this at a high enough setting that I can see it outdoors when it's sunny and when there's snow out. Okay, so Holosun did recommend I power this, you know, power it down, but that's that's just not going to work because um, that's just not how the world is where I live. Okay, so I have to have this at a. See, when it goes to the tree, you can see it. When it goes into the snow, you can barely see it. I mean, you can see it. Now the snow, now the sun's starting to go. And you can't, you you know, you can't, you can see it uh, if it's this bright. Okay, if I power it down, I would not be able to see it. So I have to run it at that brightness setting. Um, so uh, you know, I pretty much have accepted that every, uh, uh, pretty much every month, I gotta be changing the battery. So I have a whole bunch of these 1632 batteries. Um, but I, I, I'm kind of just putting this information out there so that you guys are aware of this. Uh, a couple of people have told me in the past that, hey, you know, uh, power it down or maybe it's defective. It's not defective. Uh, I have a few of these. You know, I have a couple of these 507Ks. Um, the thing is that when you're carrying around with you all day, and I carry this around, uh, you're constantly in motion. So the optic doesn't get a chance to go to sleep. Okay? If you have it in your safe, right it powers down it goes to sleep when you pick it up it, it shakes awake when you're carrying it around all day it it's it's always active it's always using up that battery it would be very useful if Sun would give us a solar panel you know with an auto adjust feature in this so at least when you put it into your holster which is where it's going to be like 99 percent of the time uh when it's in your holster uh, it senses that it's dark and it powers down as it is right now I have to keep this at a setting where I can see it in the daytime when it's sunny and when there's snow out and then that's how it has to go into the holster so when I pull it back out it'll be at a, at a brightness setting where I can see the reticle um, and it's just that it consumes the battery much faster so I know that shot show is coming up in a couple of weeks uh, how Sun will probably be uh, releasing some new products. I'm hoping that the product that they release will be a Halosun 507K um, with a solar panel on it with a uh, uh, you know an, a brightness auto adjust feature. Okay, so uh, put this battery in on November 22nd. It's now January 10. That's about six weeks. Uh, I bought this last year in June, so June 2021. During that time, this is the this is the fourth time I've changed this battery. So basically, I'm, I'm getting an average of about two, you know, about one to two months of this. So that's just what it is. Other people have told me much the same. They posted comments in other videos that I have made. So that's that's just reality. You're not getting 50,000 hours out of this um, if you're if you're carrying this around all day and and you know it's constantly you know, on because you're moving, you know, it's going to get 50,000 hours if it's in your safe, not moving. Okay. So, uh, I hope this information is useful to you guys. Uh, drop some comments below. If you're not a member of the channel, subscribe, hit, hit that bell button. So you get the notifications. I'll talk to you guys soon.